Solve the radical equation, the square root of 16 minus x squared equals 5, in three different ways. In part a, solve algebraically and check for extraneous roots. Rewrite the equation. Square both sides of the equation to get rid of the radical. This gives us 16 minus x squared equals 25. Subtract 16 from both sides of the equation to get negative x squared equals 9. Divide each side of the equation by negative 1 to get x squared equals negative 9. Square root both sides. The square root of negative 9 is not a real number. There is no solution to this equation. In part b, we'll solve by finding the point of intersection of a system of equations. We can solve this equation by finding the point of intersection for the graphs y1 equals the square root of 16 minus x squared, and y2 equals 5. Draw the graph of each function. There are no points of intersection, so there are no real solutions. In part c, we'll solve by finding the x-intercepts of a single function. We need to make this equation equal 0. Bring all of the terms to one side. This gives us the square root of 16 minus x squared minus 5 equals 0. If we graph the function y equals the square root of 16 minus x squared minus 5, the x-intercepts of the graph will be roots of the equation. Draw the graph of y equals the square root of 16 minus x squared minus 5. There are no x-intercepts, so there are no real solutions.